going on guys welcome again to tech world vlogs and tesla here i'm in st martin but i'm on the french side of st martin and look at this backdrop here uh this is a beautiful backdrop here on the french side of st martin and we're down on a shopping area on this side this is called uh, ventura shopping center i hope i said it right we have a lot of different stores on this side here and i hope you enjoy the drive through we drove through from Dutch side of St. Martin all the way over to the French side. I know it's uh, it's quite an experience. It looks a lot like uh, countryside living in France. All the signs on the road, all this, um, all the store names and brands all have the French uh, names. So it's kind of hard for us to understand, but it's quite unique. It's different. It's um, weird to have one island split in two, a French and a that side but it's definitely different you can actually uh, see the difference on the both sides of the island um, it's busy this is an intersection here with lots of traffic it's a roundabout so you can um, go to different areas and on the shopping plaza aventura you have la express there are just different places to shop so we're gonna tour this side a little bit more experience the french side of st martin but i do love it i feel a little bit more french on this side uh just the way how everything is set up and we're going to interact with uh, the locals here we're going to talk to them we're going to experience some french food um, and practice our french here on this side so looking forward to it hope hopefully you guys like the drive through the countryside drive through of uh st martin on the french side make sure you like subscribe uh, leave a comment below let me know if there's a place that you visited here on the French side that you like and recommend um, and hopefully you book a tour on uh, St. Martin and come and check it out yourself it's really really amazing in person I must say in one of those places that surprised me never thought I would see this beauty um, in St. Martin so very developed very safe um, and just elegant that's the one thing that describes St. Martin is just elegant all right so on the front side you gotta check out the bakery i'm at this store called le express and we're gonna check out some beautiful french bakery um and if you're from toronto this might look a lot like montreal but um yeah this is elegant this is delicious so let's take a look at what we have here on the selection uh, also one pound is equal to 1.12 usd um so that's declared right here on the front counter most of the currency is USD. Let's check out the food here. Really, really good. That's called a carabiz, four dollars and fifty uh, pounds. And then we have some panini sandwich here. Um, and then we have empanadas, a regular subway sandwich. This looks really delicious. Absolutely delicious. Also, dining is really good. They have lots of space where you can dine and have a nice uh, setting. Some salads. Also, like a buffet here. These are made fresh every morning. Um, young lady was saying if you come early in the morning, it's full. But throughout the day, it goes down in terms of supply. Uh, but it's freshly break every morning all right so i'm off to the next adventure but i gotta get a shot of espresso here it looks really good um i'm gonna grab this here and i'm gonna go off and see what else i can find on this side of the island so i'm just gonna keep walking around and experience the street life here it's pretty um right now it's middle of the day so a lot of people are uh, inside sun is kind of baking hot uh, but the stores are open so we're gonna see what we find here 
next up here is a little plaza here um, as you can see a couple lot of stores here a clothing store here another clothing store here and I think this is a restaurant here so I'm gonna check it out see what it looks like inside and uh, do a walkthrough on the French side of St. Martin inside that store uh, it's got one island store just reopened about two weeks ago it is beautiful it's elegant it reminds me of Montreal Montreal have a lot of these boutique stores um, but it's clean I love the merchandise inside here as you can see hats all French uh, outfit uh, great material and I have the young ladies here they want to say hi so I'm gonna put them on video here uh, what's your name Leonie. Leonie? Yes. You want to say hi to anyone, Leonie? Hi, everyone. <laughs> anyone? Your mom, dad, anyone? Um, yes. Hi, mom and dad. All right, Leonie is uh, one of the employees here at the store. Um, just reopened, right? Two weeks ago. Yes. Awesome. How you like it here? I like it. You've been on the uh, living here for a long time. Yeah, I I was born here. Oh, awesome. Yes. Yeah, beautiful island. Yeah. Yes. Every day is just really? spectacular. Awesome, we have a couple more young ladies, a little camera shy, but uh, <laughs> you want to say hi to anyone? What's your name? Jerisa. Jerisa, you want? I just want to show the brand. So yeah. if you come to St. Martin, you can come to the One Love, One Life, One Island store and visit us. There you go, One, one Love, One Island, One Life. Visit this store, make sure you ask for these long, young ladies, they'll give you a great price and they'll also make sure you get the right stuff when you're buying. Uh, where's the other one? She's shy? She's gone. Oh, she hi? <laughs> Oh, okay, all right. Hey, um, this was a nice adventure. Eh? Love checking out these little shops, promoting small business. That's our brand right here on this channel. So make sure you check it out, like, subscribe, and we'll see with the next store later. Hey, that was really nice. The girls were able to say shout out to their family friends. Store was beautiful, amazing quality material. Um, unfortunately, I'm packing light, so I don't want to take back a lot of stuff. But yeah, definitely want to check that out and make sure you get some nice uh, outfit here if you're on the island. Uh, a couple more stores here, boutique stores for clothing. Um, if you're looking for that on this island, I'm going to all of them, but this is another store, it's called Bloom. Um, and they are pretty big. Lots of different stuff you can get here. Uh, but nothing beats the mountain view that we have there. Look at this backdrop over here. Spectacular, just spectacular. Imagine living here and seeing that every morning. That is just uh, breathtaking. All right, so I found that not a store. Uh, it's actually a market, it's called Hope Market. I'm gonna check it out there and see what they have to offer. And then we have the folks over there, they're selling. Hey, how are you doing? Nice to you. What are you selling here? Chicken, bro. Chicken, oh, okay. Let me go check them out. So they're selling chicken over there, uh, out of the car. So I'm gonna check it out there. See what they got here. This, this is the best way to sell because you don't have to pay for a store. You don't have to pay for store. You don't have to pay a rent okay, ending. This is free. Yeah, this is free. Yeah. What you got here? I got chicken with uh, olives and ginger, bro. Oh, nice, nice, nice. I do a YouTube channel. Uh, so there's a couple I meet here that's Hi. selling in the French side of St. Martin. Chicken, olives, and what you said? Ginger. And ginger. Right. So this must be delicious. Let's check it out. Y'all want to say anything to the fans there on YouTube? Oh, it's okay. You want to say hi? Appreciate this video, and this guy is very nice. Yes. <laughs> So give me a sample here. I'm gonna I'm gonna try it out. See what it's, what it's all about. Who made it? Who cooked it? I did it. You did it. Me the chef. This morning. This morning. Freshly, freshly made this morning. And this is chef. And he had a helper here. She's reading a book. She's entertaining herself with a nice book. What's the book? Oh, nice, beautiful. Yeah, the ambiance is awesome. Love this backdrop. You cannot get enough of this backdrop here. So this is the rice he's taking out. Not too much, eh? Because I still much? gotta eat more food. Yeah, you, just, you, 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 you have to try? Just a little try, yeah. So I'm, gonna, I'm gonna give you a, a nice one, huh? Yeah. So if people wanna find this uh, mobile restaurant, how can they find you? Always here every day or? This is our first yeah. time. This is the first day. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, so I'm day. actually doing a promotion video. This is the first time trying out this, uh, this style of restaurant. So I'm gonna test it out. If I like it, y'all gotta come and check this food out. This is the chicken right here. It doesn't look as sexy as it did this morning, but oh. it's good. So, what's your name? 
Let me see. Amisi said it doesn't look as sexy as it would this morning, <laughs> but it's still gonna be delicious. I know that. Oh yes, you know that. That's the olive right there with the chicken. So it's chicken out. Not so much. I just wanna eat it right here. Okay. Are you ready right And I'll get a live uh, direct feedback on how it uh, what the quality is, right? Amazing. And then you're gonna subscribe to the channel so you can see the video. Yeah, of Fuck course. Yeah. Alright. I just need this here. Alright, so this is my first taste of the mobile restaurant. This is chicken, olives, and rice. Let's mm. check this out. It's some hard work. What time does it take to prepare this? How long? Two or three hours? Mmm, two or three hours. Good. Oh, I love the olives. Olives are really nice. Yeah, you love that? Yeah. Mm. We had a whole debate on how to cut the olives. Oh, yeah? And a half and fours. And Who won the debate? She won. She I won mean, it. I mean, I ended up doing a bit of every yeah? type of cutting. <laughs> It's delicious, I love that. Look at that. Yay! Oh, love it. I like the onions. There's the onion. Because there's a the citrusness, very citrus. Yeah, bro. So, where do you get the olives from? No supermarket. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you didn't grow the olives yourself? No, no. they don't come from grapes. <laughs> but they come from friends. No. So, how long y'all been on the island? Uh, five months. We're leaving at the end of the month to Colombia. Oh wow, so y'all travel a lot? Yeah, I do, yeah. No? Yeah, we both travel everywhere in the world. How many countries have you been so far? I mean, we just left. We just left France five months ago. Oh, okay. Yeah, so so this is the beginning step. of the first stop. Yeah, but we, we have been lucky uh, when yeah. we were smaller, you know, okay. when, we, when we were younger. So, we so who knew. came up with the idea to this him, is like raise money, him, right? Him, yeah. Yeah, this one? Mm -hmm. it. Yeah, to raise money and to, you know, have an activity, yeah. to enjoy. And he loves to cook, he especially loves to cook. French okay. food. Yeah, I love to cook. So, uh, what's your name? Manuel. Manuel loves hey. to cook. A little history. Five months ago, they left France to come to St. Martin. They have a dream to travel the whole world. And I love to see young people embracing that dream. Um, and this is the first concept of a restaurant. And they're going to be very successful. I wish them all the best on that journey that they're on. Um, but please make sure if you see them around, say hi, wave them. Y'all gonna do video or y'all gonna website or anything no, that people can follow you? Instagram? Yeah, yeah, maybe we don't know. Maybe, maybe or, but they, they're just gonna travel. If you see them, say hi, give them a wave, um, help them out so that they could continue that journey. Uh, was there a reason why you decided to uh, like travel the world? Anything that motivated you? Yeah. Obvious reasons? Yeah, like I don't wanna stay in the same place for too long. I don't want to have a casual job. Uh, I don't, don't like cities too. Well, that's What's the, your name? Orlando. 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 Well, nice, nice to meet yeah, you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. All right. So we'll say bye to them for now. Y'all, good luck. Bye Peace bye. out. Enjoy your journey. And we'll see where life takes you. Yeah? All, right. All right. So now we're off to Marigo to check out uh, the biggest city here on the French side um, of St. Martin. And then Mullet Beach is something that a lot of people recommend to check out. So I'll check that out too. And let's see, um, we'll see you when we get the